A certain university offers courses that are either three credits or four credits per course each semester. A student registered for a total of 16 credits for the fall semester, which equation represents the possible number of three credit courses X and four credit forces Y that the student could have registered. So total number of credits from X courses is 3X and total number of credits from Y courses is 4Y, which should be 16. So 3X plus 4Y is 16. The function F is defined by this. What is the Y intercept of the graph? So three, because FX is Y, which is MX plus C and C is the Y intercept. So zero comma three. Uh, yeah, these two options are the same. The graph shown models the monthly revenue in millions of dollars for a particular marketing company from June through October. According to the model, which of the following is closest to this company's monthly revenue for June 2009? Okay, so June 2009 is starting from here, so a little less than 10. So that would be 8.5. In the figure shown, right triangle ABC is similar to right triangle EDC where angle ACB is congruent to angle ECD. ACB is congruent to this and AE is 15. AE is 15. Okay. What is the length of CE? Okay. So CE to CA will be 6 to 3, which is 2 because the corresponding sides will be in the same ratio. So CE will be 2 by 3 or 15, right? Because the ratio of this to this is 2 is to 1. So that's 10. Option D. Which polynomial is equivalent to this? 12x to the power 4 plus 6 is 18x uh, to the power 4. So A and B are out. Uh, then you have 13x squared. Yeah, this 13x squared, then minus 5x plus 7x is plus 2x, 18 minus 9 is 9. The equation relates the positive numbers w, x, y, and z, which equation correctly expresses x in terms of this. So y is x plus w by z. So y, z is x plus w. So X is Y, Z minus W, A. The given linear function models the annual percentage increase in the population of India X years after 1990. What is the best interpretation of G20 equal to 1.376? So G20 would mean 20 years after 1990, right? The uh, annual percentage increase in the population is 1.376. So 20 years after 1990, the percentage increase in the population was 1.376 over the previous year. Uh, what is the annual percentage increase, right? Yeah. So that would be the percentage increase over the previous year. So C. For the quadratic function shown, A, B, and C are constants. For the graph of Y is equal to Fx, the quadratic function opens upward and the coordinates of its vertex are both negative. Which of the following could be true? Coordinates. Okay, so it looks like this, right? So then A is positive because it's the leading coefficient and it's opening upward. And uh, B and C will be negative, right? So uh, A is positive and B and C are negative, C. How many solutions does the given system of equations have? Okay, so uh, let me just... This can be written as uh, x plus 3y is 10, and this is 2x plus y is 10, right? So this will have, if you do a1 by a2, which is 1 by 2, and b1 by b2, which is 3, 
they are not equal. So this will have one solution. What is the sum of the solutions of this equation? Absolute value of 2x plus 6 is 4. So 2x plus 6 is plus minus 4. So 2x is minus 6 plus minus 4, which is minus 10 and minus 2. Uh, yes, so x is minus 5 and minus 1. So the sum is negative 6. The shaded region shown represents the solutions to which inequality. Okay, so let's first find the equation of the line. Uh, it passes through 0, 0,3 and minus 1, 0. So slope is 3 by 1. And the y-intercept is 3. So y is 3x plus 3. And this is the region below the line. So it will be y is less than or equal to 3x plus 3. Okay, so that is 3x plus 3 is greater than or equal to y. So 3x minus y is greater than or equal to minus 3. 3x minus y is greater than or equal to minus 3. The graph shown models the height of a volleyball x seconds after it was hit by a player. Which equation represents the relationship between the height of the volleyball and the time since the volleyball was hit? Okay, so the vertex is this uh, point two five comma uh, six. So I can write it as y is equal to a x minus point two five squared plus six. Right? Yeah. So that seems to look like option D. And to find a, we can use the fact that it passes through 0, 0,5. So 5 is a times 0.25 the whole squared, which is how much? Let's plug this in. I'll just keep it as 0.25 into 0.25 for now. 0.25 squared plus 6. So A will be minus 1 over 0.25 squared. So that's minus 1 uh, into 16. Yeah, so it's minus 16. So that's option D. Trapezoid A and trapezoid B are shown as similar. The length of each side of A is 8 times the length of corresponding side of B. Area of trapezoid A is how many times as large? So area is proportional to length square. So it would be 64. The function defined by this, what is the y-intercept of the graph? So for the y-intercept, we'll put x as 0. So y-intercept will be minus 8 into 6 to the power 0 minus 4. So minus 8 minus 4, which is minus 12. So a. Which of the following is equivalent to this? So root 2q plus root r to the power 2 by 3. So this becomes the third root of uh, root 2q plus root r the whole squared. So the third root of 2q squared, no, just 2q, not 2q squared. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, so that would be uh, two two q plus uh, r plus two times root two q r, right? So that would be third root of two q plus, uh, wait, what did I do? Mm, two times root of two QR. Uh, two Q plus R plus two times root of two QR, right? 
Okay, so this question is supposed to have root to R. So let me just change that. Okay. Yeah, so it's supposed to be this. It's supposed to be root to Q plus root to R to the power two by three. Right, so that would be third root of root to q plus root to r squared which is third root of 2q plus 2r plus 2 times uh, 4qr which is third root of 2q plus 2r plus 4 times root qr third root of 2q plus 2r plus 4 times root qr option d Okay, so 3x is 15, so x is 5, so 2x is 10. What is the positive solution? x square minus 9 is 16. So x square is 25, so 5 is the positive solution. Line P is defined by this. Line R is perpendicular to line P. What is the slope of line R? Okay, so P is uh, 2y plus 4x is 9. So its slope is minus 4 by 2. So that's minus 2. So the slope of R will be half negative reciprocal. If this is true, what is 2x? 2x minus 2x by 3 minus 2 is x by 3 plus 1. So 2x by 3 minus x by 3 is 3. So x by 3 is 3. So x is 9. So 2x is 18. Points A and B lie on a circle with radius 4 and arc AB has this length. Length of arc AB is what fraction of the circumference of the circle? Okay, so 4 pi by 5 divided by 2 pi r right uh, length of rkb is what fraction right so that pi and pi cancels uh, 4 and 4 cancels 1 by 10 okay let's grade this okay B, D, A, D, C, B, D. Okay, so this was supposed to be D then. This has to be something else, maybe zero comma negative three or something. Okay, A, D, C, number six, A, C, C, B, A. Six is... A, C, C, B, A. 11 is B, D, D, A, D. B, D, D, A, D, and 16. Uh, 16, 10, 5, half, 18.1, 10, 5, half, 18, 1 by 10. 